Last time, Cece and her family all return to Posse at last. Tommy has a strange recurring nightmare. <gasps> Helena enlists Atornik's help, but only on his terms. I lit with Helena that you stop calling me Zotto. Sergeant Thomas's true identity and secret past is revealed. I'm sure that you're my papa. Come on, son. We haven't finished looking over our beautiful castle. See you later. Think of something. Hey, Cece, would you like to visit the castle? It would really make me happy. If you'd like, Tommy. Mm. Don't go too far. Argus might still be around. Here's Count Arcus's ballroom. Oh, it sure doesn't look like he used it much. It's even dirtier than all the other rooms. What a shame! Allowing a castle like this to get into such a state. Well, now that it's ours, we're gonna make good use of it. And let others make use of it, too. What do you mean, Tommy? I thought we could have a big party to celebrate our coming and Arcus's going. That's a great idea, Tommy. Ever since this place was built, all the villagers have been dying to see inside. Yes. But we'll really have to clean it up, and there aren't many of us. No problem. For a party, I'm sure our friends will be more than happy to give us a hand. I'll go to the village and ask them. Tell me, Tommy, have you got something up your sleeve? I want to invite Franz and the Empress without Cece finding out. As soon as Franz and Cece are face to face, they won't be able to stay mad. That's a wonderful idea, my son. I'll go prepare the invitations immediately. Come on, Shadow, let's go. Let those rats get some sleep. <laughs> How can you swallow that nasty stuff? But it's full of good things, you know. Some berries, leaves, and a few roots. Well, it's all yours. Mm -hmm. I'd rather set some traps to capture some tasty game. Rabbits, partridges, maybe even a deer. <gasps> oh. Oh, mm. huh? Count Arcus! Snidely, finally. So what's going on? What? They want to clean my castle? Yes, Count. They're expecting a visit from Empress Sophia and Prince Franz. Never. I will never let Tommy and his father entertain the court of Yenna in my castle. 
and as for Elizabeth meeting her prince there, I'll burn it to the ground first. If you burn down the castle, Count, th there won't be a party, but you'll never be able to return. <laughs> Why don't we turn the party into a royal disaster instead? Hmm. The Empress will leave angry. Franz will break up with Cece for good. Tommy and his father will be the laughing stock of Bavaria. I'm a genius! Mmm. Mmm. That was a royal feast. <laughs> Argus is gonna catch all the animals of the forest in his traps. We should tell our parents and the villagers. No, we can't. They can't clean up the castle and go chase Argus and his men at the same time. We're gonna manage by ourselves, like grown-ups. I even think that I have an idea. Thanks for answering the call, everyone. Now let's get to work. Good luck. Found it. Snaggy was right. Have you finished setting the traps? So now, all we have to do is wait for nightfall to retrieve the game and get ready for Tommy's party in our own special way. So everyone understands. Not a word to Cece. You can count on us, Tommy. I'll pass the word on to everyone. That Tommy. Organizing all this to cheer Cece up and get her back together with Franz. What a wonderful idea. By the way, Matt. This might also be a good chance for you to put aside your differences with Empress Sophia. You're absolutely right, Ludovica. I'm going to write her a welcome speech. Hmm. You know something? I love you. Whether you like it or not, Franz, you'll go to this party. Tommy has graciously invited us to his castle. It would upset him very much if you weren't present. I'd like to accept his invitation, Mother, but the affairs of Empire... ...will be taken care of by Karl. Come now, Franz, you aren't going to keep brooding because Cece didn't answer your letter. I know how you feel, Franz, especially since Cece must have forgotten all about you by now. Mind your own business, Helena. Very well, Mother. I'll go. Perfect. Go get ready quickly. We leave in an hour. Tommy expects us tomorrow at noon. No! Ridiculous! And I'm not even invited. However, there is an extra invitation. Since Carl will have to stay here, it would be a shame not to use it. Tommy would be just so crushed. It's strange, Helena. I always thought that Tommy and you didn't really get along. But as long as he has invited you... Oh, Your Majesty! Tommy and I have become the best friends in the world! There. Everything's finally ready for tomorrow. everyone and see you tomorrow at the party that's right everybody see you tomorrow for a truly memorable party <laughs> looks just like it did before we cleaned it up. Oh, if I get my hands on the rascal that ate all the cakes I made yesterday, then my roast chickens... And you didn't hear a thing last night? But who could have done this? Who? I can only think of one person capable of being so mean. Arcus! Thanks for the compliment, everyone. In any case, we aren't going to let Arcus spoil our party. If we all pitch in, it'll take place as scheduled. You said it, Duke Max. I'll mobilize everyone. 
and I'll post some men at the entrances so Arcus can't get in or spoil the festivities. Oh, they won't give up. Well then, neither will I. I'll ruin their little party, or my name isn't Arcus. But if we try to pull something else, they'll know it was us. And we'll be caught like rats in the castle. Let me think, Snidely. Let me think. We're almost there. Psst. Here, Critters. Come here. for sure. You certainly won't be getting dessert. We'll just have to start all over again. Papa! The Imperial Escort! It's coming! We have to save time. Tommy, the children, and myself will welcome Prince Franz and the Empress. Burgomaster, I'm putting you in charge of the final cleanup. Don't worry, Cece. Our friends will take care of everything. Go find your mother instead. I think she has a surprise for you. A surprise? Well, that sure is a surprise, all right. And now what do we do, Count? I'm thinking, Snidely. I'm thinking. To the Gluck residence, Your Majesty. Hooray! Long live the Empress! <laughs> yeah. Mr. Gluck, dear children, your welcome has touched me deeply. It is a great honor for me to be welcomed by the true proprietors of this magnificent castle. The honor is entirely ours, Majesty, and it will be my pleasure to show you around while we wait for lunch. Oh, Tommy, Tommy, it was so nice of you to invite me. <gasps> But I didn't invite her. Mama, this is crazy. Such a fancy dress for such a simple party. All parties are important, my Cece. And this one maybe even more than the others. Arcus never gives up. The Prince and the Empress have just arrived, Count. Found it. An idea, an idea. My castle for an idea. Gregor, stop! Huh? Save your concoction for our dear guests. But Count Arcus, I'm finished my chicken. It's all I've got left and I'm hungry. What a shame. Such nice mush. Thank you. Thanks, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. You can stop looking for me, Franz. I'm right here by your side. I wasn't looking for you, Helena. 
That Bavarian food is much too heavy. Mm. But I don't see Cece. Is she ill? She's getting ready, Majesty. We kept your arrival from her. It's a surprise. In fact, I have another surprise for you. So? You're sulking? <laughs> <laughs> Franz? Helena? Oh no, that's impossible. Cece? <laughs> so my cooking is too heavy, hmm? Then my cake? What will she think of my cake? Well, Cece, are you feeling better? I was just so surprised to see Franz here laughing with Helena. He doesn't love me anymore, that's for sure. <laughs> Franz still loves you? Since you didn't answer his letter, he even came to tell you in person. He didn't get my letter? He wrote to me? Oh, oh! then that changes everything. Tell me, tell me. You're the one who organized all of this, I suppose? And without telling me? You know what, Tommy? I adore you. Oh, the, the cake! cake! The cake, finally. Uh, this cake looks delicious. No, not her, not Helena. Hmm, Cece hasn't come down. The Empress has disappeared, and Prince Franz is in a state of melancholy. We must do something, or the party will end up a disaster. As a matter of fact, <clears throat> I prepared a speech. My friends, we can't have a party without music. Huh? If you'll please take your seats, I'll play you a Bavarian jig. I'll never get to deliver it. Oh, a dance just for us. Come quick, Franz. Oh, what's wrong with me? Oh. Cece! Franz! Oh, Franz, forgive me. Your letter never reached me. And you never received mine. I thought you didn't love me anymore. You mean you wrote a letter too? But then... How could we be so silly? <laughs> <laughs> Life is great! Cece and Franz are back together! <laughs> Let the party begin! Bravo! Love in the fiancés! Confound this business! We failed again! No, no, no! It's not fair! Yeah. I'm afraid your plan for revenge is a washout, Count. What did you say, Snidely? Washout? There's my brilliant idea. Ha! <laughs> what did I tell you? Argus never gives up! Silence! Your attention, if you please! My friends, the place that you are about to visit is protected by all of the children present here. To enter, you must swear to respect it. We swear. We swear. Fantastic! My friends, I have something important to say. So do we. We're making it official once and for all. Our wedding will now take place... In one week! And you're all invited, of course! Hooray! Long live Rome! Congratulations, my children! <laughs> and to places with my speech. Oh no, Papa! You're forgetting your vow! How dare you! To celebrate the event, I suggest a Viennese hot chocolate in this marvelous garden. Don't move, I'll go get it. It's so quiet in there. Doesn't sound like people having a party. I don't believe it! They're gone! Come on, Gregor, let's go join the Count! Marcus. You'll just have to pay for everyone, Elizabeth. Oh. 
Don't get away from me! Argus never gives up! The sister! Ah! Ah! What's going on? It's coming from the ballroom! Quick! Hurricane? A tornado? No, Arcus, a real natural disaster. Now, would someone be kind enough to help me down? <sighs> You're always in the right place at the right time, aren't you, Cece? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I'm so sick. Oh, 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 my stomach. Oh. Don't be too late coming back to Vienna, children. Don't worry, Majesty. Nothing in the world could delay our Mara. <laughs> Not even a bad cold. Arcus never gives. People say I am just too bold.